the Garmin Forerunner 965 is a beautiful piece of tech. And yet for all that beauty, most people are still rocking the factory watch face like it's a rental car. It's like buying a Tesla and never changing the radio station. I see this happen because it's weirdly not intuitive. You expect a long press and a few swipes, and instead you get lost in menus about power modes and widgets. Garmin really doesn't hold your hand here, so let me walk you through it. First, from your watch face, press and hold the top left button. That's the light button. But on a long press, it opens the quick settings menu. This is where half the magic happens, and most people don't even know it exists. Now, in the quick settings, scroll down using the bottom right button until you hit the little gear icon. That's your settings hub. It's like the central nervous system of your Garmin universe. Tap it with the top right button to go in. Inside settings, scroll down until you see watch face. This is what we're after. Select it. Now it'll open your currently applied face, and here's what people miss. It gives you that minimal preview, but with hidden options underneath. Scroll left or right through the available watch faces. Garmin has a few built in, and while they aren't flashy, they are functional. Digital, analog, compact data, like flavors of oatmeal. And if none of these do it for you, that's totally fine. Once you find one you want to apply, press the top right button to select it. You can stop here if you're happy. But if you want to change colors or data fields, hit the bottom right button again to go into customize mode. Here's where it gets fun. In customization, you can change everything from the color scheme to what each data spot displays, heart rate, battery, steps, weather. It becomes your dashboard. Think of it like rearranging the cockpit of your spaceship. Once you're happy with your edits, just press the top right button again to lock it in. Garmin doesn't make a big deal of confirming things, so if it feels anticlimactic, that's normal. Your changes are saved silently, like a ninja. If none of the native faces cut it, install the Garmin Connect IQ Store app on your phone. This is their version of an app store. Pop that open, search for watch faces, and prepare to go down a rabbit hole. Some are gorgeous. Some, not so much. From the app, tap a face you like, hit install, and boom. If your watch is synced, it'll magically show up in your list under watch face. A recent one I downloaded counted my daily coffee consumption. Four today. It was a slow morning. Pro tip, many custom faces eat more battery depending on how busy they are, especially if they update constantly. Stick to simpler faces if you like going days without charging. My battery life improved by nearly 30% just switching designs. If you want to switch back to a previous one, repeat the same steps. Garmin automatically keeps the last few you've used, so you can toggle between them pretty easily. It's like switching from sneakers to dress shoes, but on your wrist.